Alright, so in today's quick tutorial, I want to show you something very, very cool that actually not many people know, and that is how to scale in perspective. Now, let's jump straight into Affinity Photo and let me show you how this is done. So here in Affinity Photo, you can see I've opened this image. It's probably Australia because you can see the kangaroo. Um, and you see that we've got some nice sign over here. I extracted this sign already, so we've got the sign on its own layer. And let's say now I want to put this sign along this road, but in perspective. Now, the wrong way is just scale this thing down and just put it somewhere. And let's yeah, just figure out um, how this actually looks good somewhere around here and yeah this looks pretty okay but this is not the right way to do this so let me show you how this is done now i've drawn a couple of lines which are these lines and these lines i basically drew to decide where the horizon line is or where the vanishing point is now what i've done is i basically just follow the road with the first line so let me disable the other two i clicked here i just followed the road 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 and that was this line then i did the same for this part of the road so i just clicked right over here and followed the road until we found this point and then i did the same with the fence so i just took one of the lines I followed it and there we have our vanishing point so where the lines intersect that is our vanishing point and this point is very important um, for this technique to know now let's select our sign layer and what we want to do now is go uh, onto our toolbar or context toolbar and with the move tool selected you can see that we have got this little thing right over here which enables our transform origin now if we click on this you can see that our transform origin is in the center right now which basically means that if we would rotate this thing or if we would scale it down holding command or control that we would um, scale it to this point let's say so let me press command uh, z a couple of times to undo this now what we want to do is we want to uh, move our transform origin to the vanishing point so let's move it somewhere around here this looks fine to me let's actually disable our uh, lines for now and what happens now if we would scale this thing uh, while holding command or control because if we would scale this normal nothing would really happen but if we would hold command or control and we would scale this thing down right now you can actually see that it yeah just follows the vanishing point so now we know exactly how this how to scale this sign uh, perfectly following yeah the rules of nature i guess so let's just put one right over here let's press command j once again to duplicate this thing and let's put one in the foreground maybe right over here because why not and now you know how to scale things in perspective but perhaps you're also interested in learning how to create realistic water reflections if so check this video out right over here see you in the next one ciao ciao